everyone, we're going to find the first term in common difference of the arithmetic sequence where the 14th term is negative 1 and the 18th term is negative 9. I set this up already for you, but I'll explain that in a minute. And we're also going to um, do the recursive and explicit formula once we have our first term and our common difference. So to get these formulas um, or this system of equations, I use this uh, explicit formula. So basically it's saying the 14th term, and this is your n, the number of terms. So um, the 14th term is negative 1. And then when you get to the 18th term, we get to negative 9. All right, so I use this formula. I wrote, well, my 14th term is um, a plus n minus 1 times d. Well, your n is 14. So 14 minus 1 is just 13. So this number here is always going to be 1 less. Um, than your nth term. So the 18th term was um, not negative 9. Yeah, it was. Uh, when you do in your 18th term, you just go one less. So now we have our system. Let's just write it down. a plus 13t equals negative 1. And a plus 17t equals negative 9. And using elimination, we're going to eliminate our a. So a minus a is 0. 13d minus 17d is negative 4d. So let's see, is that right? Yeah. And then negative 1 minus a negative 8, negative 9, is negative 1 plus uh, 9, which is 8. So your uh, d equals um, negative 2. So we found our common difference and now all we have to do is plug that into one of these formulas. I just usually use the first one. a plus 13 substitute the d for negative 2 equals negative 1. So a equals negative 26. Oops. a plus uh, negative 26 equals negative 1. And then um, take that out. Add 26 to both sides. So A is going to be 25. So your first term um, is going to be 25. And your common difference is negative 2. So we answered the first question. So your first term <coughs> was 25. And your D was negative 2. Now we have to write a recursive formula. So you just copy that down basically. You're just going to write a sub n. I'm saying sub for subscript. a sub n equals a sub n minus 1 plus your d. So that's really going to be minus 2. And for your explicit formula, which is really the same as your nth term, you're just going to use this formula and substitute in your a and d. So your explicit formula or nth term is a sub n equals 25 plus n minus 1 times negative 2. This one you have to simplify. So you get 25 minus 2n plus 2. That's going to give you a sub n. Just combine those two and you get 27 minus 2n. And that's it. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.